Hey, welcome. It's time to have a quick look at the XTAR VC4 lithium ion battery charger. So I picked this up. I'm finding I'm using a lot more 18650 lithium ions and stuff, and I still use nickel metal hard drives. So uh, let's have a quick look at this. So this is the VC4. You can also get a two bay one called the VC2, obviously. This is simplicity personified. One single button on the front for displaying which channels you're charging on and uh, input. The cable that comes with it is a standard USB on one end, USB 3 by the looks of the colour blue, to a DC barrel jack, just plugs in and plug it into a good old phone charger. 5 volt, 2.1 amp input and that means you can charge these channels at 1 amp each. So I'm finding myself using more lithium ion batteries of various sizes and I've been making do with a different charger but for now this has been absolutely brilliant. 18650, 16650, 14500s, I'm using 16500s as well and AA nickel metal hydrides, it'll do triple A's. There's all the batteries that it does, I'll overlay a screenshot. VC4 has over voltage protection, um, reverse polarity and it has a recovery feature so if you get these below like 3 volts some charges can be a bit finicky this will trickle charge these back to a safe state uh, if applicable I've tried some nickel metal hydrides, really old ones and it brought them back to life so that's all good I'm going to swap the camera out for one that will pick this screen up a lot better than this so bear with me Okay, this is the VC4 booting up, main screen, you've got two main dials and the little one is your charging current. So let me load this up with batteries quick and I'll explain what's what. Right, channel 1 I've just put an 18650 in, channels 3 and 4 have got AA nickel metal hydrides. As you see on the dial on the left here, it's showing lithium ion and the dial is representative of the voltage you might expect from a lithium ion, all the way up to 4.2. Uh, the flashing figure here is how much current is currently being put in to the battery. Channel 1 here, channel 3 here. A quick press on the button just toggles which channel is displayed. So there you go, channel 4. Half an amp input. I think that's half an amp for each channel. Only other thing, the lights change. When you're done, you get a green light and it will flash full and show you how many milliamps is put into the battery. So, well there's the VC4, it is really so simple to use, I've been using it for a couple of weeks now, spring loaded negative ends are really really heavy duty, really happy with it, trust it, I've checked a couple of times for a fully charged battery, lithium ion that is, and it came out 4.195 to 197, so it's not even a tenth of a volt out on its final charge so can't go wrong with it get yourself one if you're thinking about it well worth it well th thanks for watching any questions always happy to answer take care see you later Yeah, buddy. Hey.